Okay, you ready? Yeah. We're on video? Go All right. Ready? Yeah. Okay. Hi, this is what your lab quest looks like when you get it booted up. Notice it says file sensors and you've got these icons across the top and then you've got time-based, two samples, and then 10 seconds. We're gonna need to connect our sensor to this port right here. We're gonna connect it to the channel one port. So we're just gonna flip it in, connect it, and notice it immediately changes to begin reading. Notice it says right now our relative humidity is 25.51%. But it also changes the time based and the samples. And so we're gonna need to fix that. So we're gonna need to get the stylus, which is this thing right here, this little pen. We're gonna need to pull it out. Some of them are attached, this one is not. So we're gonna need to orient it this way so it's easier for you to see. And so we're going to change the sample and uh, the duration. So I'm gonna click on it with the stylus and it opens up this window. So the first thing we're gonna need to do is we're gonna need to change the time. So I'm gonna click on, I'm gonna click on the time right there and I'm gonna change it to 15 seconds. Then I'm gonna click on done. When that's done, it notices, it says I'm gonna, I need to change my rate because I'm only gonna get two samples, that's not enough. So I'm gonna change my sample rate to 10, oops, 10 samples, click on done. And this is going to collect 10 samples every second. So I'm gonna get a total of 151 sa samples during, during our uh, exercise. So we're gonna click on okay. And now, we're ready to begin sampling. So the first thing that we're gonna to need to do is, notice there's this, it looks like a go button. We're gonna click on that go button, and we're gonna click on the go button, and it's going to start collecting data. And you wanna hold the, the sensor down like this. You don't wanna to touch it, because that will influence any kind of humidity around it. And then when it's done, it gives you this graph right here. And notice that graph is slides down. So we're going to take another one. See that file cabinet right there? We're going to click on that, and then it's going to ask us for a relic or a run to. We're going to do another one. So we're going to click on that plus or that start button, and we're just going to gently move the the sensor around just so that it will collect as much air and humidity as it possibly can. There you go. I think it's done. And so now we have two runs. We have run one and run two, and notice it says all runs. So if I click on all runs, this is the, the screen that I get. All right, now your job is to test it out and stop.